Thank you so much for inviting me in. I was just really concerned when he never showed up for school today. Uh, is he just in his room? <laughs> it's been so long since I visited. <laughs> just up the stairs and to the left? <laughs> no, no, I promise. I don't need anything to drink. I'll make it quick. Okay, thanks again. <laughs> Hello? Ooh, you're awake. Hmm. So, why weren't you at school today? Hmm, you left me on my own. I was so bored. Why would you abandon me so? How could you be so selfish? Did you even think to put my needs before yours? <laughs> I'm jesting. So, what's wrong? Your ears. Oh, you have sore ears? What did you do? Nothing? That's strange. Do you suffer from earaches as a child or something? I'm not sure how much knowledge I have on the subject. <laughs> have you taken any medicine? No. You're just going to wait it out? Always so stubborn, huh? Well, at least you're in luck. You've got me to look after you. <laughs> now, I'm not going to do anything silly, but do you think I could clean your ears for you? It might bring you some much needed relief. You look kinda tired. <laughs> Let me come back, just one second. Do you have, like, a jug or pitcher I could borrow? Ooh, and a cloth. And maybe some q-tips? I'm going to try and relieve this pain a little. Men are always so stubborn. He's refusing to take painkillers. Like, why be so dumb? <laughs> Just to fill it up with hot water? Hopefully the steam will do it good. Thank you, that's perfect. Now, to try my best and work my magic. <laughs> Okay, thankfully didn't spill any water coming upstairs, so I hope you're proud of me because that was a Christmas miracle. Since, of course, all men are lost without the help of woman's touch. So, are you willing to let me experiment? I mean, patch you up? Because I, of course, 100% know what I'm doing. <laughs> yep. Okay, first lean forward and let me fluff up your pillow so you can sit up straight. Keep your legs out straight as well. So, first thing I'm going to do is sponge over your ears and introduce moisture to the ear canal. Just like that. Mm -hmm. Let me go behind your ear as well. Men always forget to clean behind their ears. <laughs> Let me move some of your hair out the way as well. Mm. other side. <clears throat> Can I just sit on your lap to make it easier for me? If I'm leaning over, I'm going to pull something. <laughs> there, much better. And for this ear, does it feel any better at least? Any really? Mm, not quite yet. But I can only try my best. Let me do behind the ear as well. Okay, 
Okay, now I'm going to use some Q-tips. So I'll put them in the water as well to try and get any earwax. That's what's causing pain. You're ready? Just squeeze my arm if it hurts or anything like that, okay? Okay, just nice and slowly. I'll start on the outside of the ear. And the inside. Just slow movements. Cleaning around. Okay, I'll get a new one. This time to go inside the ear and see if there's anything to get out there. Mm, there's a little earwax. Don't worry about it. It's perfectly normal. I'd be more worried if you didn't have anything in there. <laughs> mm, one more for that ear. Do you feel any relief? You do. <laughs> That's great. Okay, I'm almost done with this ear, then I go for the next one, and hopefully that does the trick too. I guess I really could be a good nurse though. That or I'm just lucky. <laughs> oh, or you're just saying that so I feel better about my efforts. You wouldn't lie to me now, would you? Not when I'm sitting on your very lap. <laughs> I'm teasing. If your mom came in now, I think she'd have a fit. Okay, almost done. Same amount of earwax, so hopefully that's a bit better. Hmm. Maybe it's just built up pressure that's causing pain. I really am no ear expert. I think all I can remember is that the smallest bones in the body are in your ear, and it's one of three. Either the hammer, anvil, or stirrup. Don't ask me what one, though. <laughs> My money is on stirrup, however. <laughs> okay, what I'll do is steam your ears one more time with the cloth and just apply lotion on your earlobes just so your body doesn't think it's time to secrete any of them oils. <laughs> on a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your service today? <laughs> hmm? <laughs> you don't need to say thank you. I'm sure you would have done the same for me. Although, maybe you'd be too shy to climb on my legs. <laughs> I suppose you just have to let me lie on you when you do it to me. <clears throat> May I use a lotion here on your ears? Yeah, totally not questionable placement. Oh, oh yeah, it's for dry skin. Sure, sure. <laughs> Got it. Okay, I'll just be quick with this, because it's probably going to be a very weird and new sensation. Hmm. Did you, um, sleep at all? You do seem kind of tired. You can close your eyes if you like. Once I'm finished, I'm just going to be heading home. You can buy me a soda after school tomorrow, which you will be going to. If you feel better, that is. I'm not going to hold you to it as much as I want to. <laughs> you are making me tired, though. I was studying hard today and used up all my brain cells. <sighs> was having to study mathematics. Algebra is too much for my pea-sized brain. I can't take it. Imagine introducing letters into mathematics. And numbers. How could they be so cruel to me? I must have annoyed someone up there. Uh, 
And I think I massaged your ears enough, though. Do you have something I could wipe my hands on? Oh, are you asleep? Ah, what's the harm if I join 